Hello everyone and welcome back to the wacky wild world of Wobble Dogs where we are currently having a pizza party! A pizza and corn party actually as we are doing our best to try to grow big dogs. We need very big dogs, dogs who are quite wide. No offense meant to you coats but you're definitely not the direction we were trying to go with that. Uh, also, no offense meant to you, a little Peapod. Also, Peapod, look, I'm just gonna pick you up and like move you over here and let you eat as much pizza as you want out of dreams of growing up to be very, very big one day. There you go, Peapod. But we are trying to make very, very big dogs because there have been a big updates with the full official release of a Wobble Dogs, including the ability to give our dogs wings, which I very, very, very deeply want to see happen. I am very excited about that. Uh, and in order to make our dogs have wings, hey, are you guys playing nice? Doodle, you be nice down there, okay? We need to unlock, possibly, at least I think this is what we need to do. We need to unlock the um, dessert machine. And we don't have the dessert machine unlocked. And the only two things I think that can make the dessert machine be unlocked is either the wide mutation or the big headed mutation. So that said, as we like surveyed everything last time, we found the best bet to try to make our dogs as big as possible is going to be with pizzas. So we're gonna just go ahead and everybody's gonna eat pizzas until we like manage to make this happen. Also, Rosebush! How are you doing, Rosebush? It looks like you and Con- Oh, Cottonball, you're starving to death! Cottonball, what is happening? All right, we need to put down some pizzas for the ghost crew. Cottonball, don't starve. Cottonball, don't starve. Here, Cottonball, eat this, eat this. Uh, here, it's all I got for just a second. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, oh, cotton ball. Cotton ball is an ancient, apparently, which I didn't even know was like a thing that could happen. And meanwhile, Rosebush of the, I, I'm pretty sure that Rosebush actually has over 100 legs. I'm gonna let you go ahead and puppate now. And then I think we'll have a pizza party for the ghosts down here as well. Uh, normally we try to feed the ghost crew something different, but I don't think we did figure out what about horns? Okay, you guys, I think we might actually try to get the horns. Let's go for the lunar pie because lunar pie apparently has the uh, caseus bacto bacteria and that can give you tiny horns. And I think that that would be so fitting for our ghost crew to eat some of the lunar pies. Let's see. All right, lunar pie is not in that one. I'm gonna go ahead and correct let's see lunar pie lunar pie is in the space themed one that's right all right that's the space food lab and space food lab we still have been trying to unlock its mystery achievement short body yellow coloration or big from onion rings i guess we could also bet on onion rings because that would give us a short body and yellow colors but it also has the big Meanwhile, a wide stance, inverted snout, long snout, short ears, and tiny horns for lunar pie. Let's just go pure lunar pie with this group for a while. We're gonna make an offering of lunar pie. And then upstairs, I actually wanna start a bit more of a proper like rose garden so that it looks nice and it's more fun for our pups. Um, and do I have any nice toys I could put in for our dogs? Give me just a second, Cotton Ball, I'm so proud of you. I don't know what you did to become ancient, but I am impressed. Let's see, I'm gonna leave the cross down here for them to play with, because that seems really fitting. I'm gonna leave both the moon boots in here, because that seems fitting too. Let's see, there's an inflatable dog, both the rubber bones. So there's three rubber bones down here now, so there's actually a lot of toys, and there's also like a lot of toilet paper. Because I want to make it so like the ghost room has a lot of fun things for people to play with. Uh, I'm going to remove the core and I'm going to put away mince core. And who's this? Just because I'm trying to rotate the dogs. Sing wing! <gasps> Sing wing! Let's go ahead and memorialize you, my dear, and let you show up. Oh jeez, everybody's ready to mutate suddenly! <laughs> Alright, well I know the rules. Oh, and Rosebush, you're actually ready to hatch. We've got a bunch of lunar pie down here now as an offering to our ghost dogs. Rosebush, because you have a hundred legs, 
Phew. All right, now you're a teenager. Sorry for the lag, guys, but because Rosebush has a hundred legs, we, okay, body with this up. <gasps> body with this up on Rosebush. Good job. That's a random mutation. That's a gain of almost 10%. Yes, Rosebush, I'm so proud of you. That was a gift from our earlier ancestors. Also, Rosebush, uh, oh, oh, sorry, Rosebush, if you want to go ahead and eat this cocoon, go for it. I don't think you're going to keep those. Uh, the cocoon bacteria apparently die off pretty quickly. So if you're going to eat them, oh man, Rosebush, 100 legs gets you straight into... Are you, are you doing okay? It's a giant pile of lunar cakes for for our ghost. We'll have to see how that works out. Oh my gosh. Yeah, sorry about the lag. That just happens because Rosebush has 100 legs. All right. And meanwhile, Snacks, do you want to come play? Oh, you can't come play with that. Here. I'm going to turn on the little, the little dancing thing. And then maybe Snacks will have a good time just hanging out over here. All right. Oh, Snacks is learning how to bounce. I'm going to praise you for bouncing because that's really cute. All right, Snacks. And if you want to eat this really quickly with your three little Cerebus cere heads, do you want to eat it? Okay. You're going to go ahead and puppet then. And let's get moving, you guys, because we do need to puppet everybody. Uh, okay. Green Bean, let's go ahead and expel you from there. Oh, geez. Everybody has been eating through our pizzas. No problem. Uh, do we have... I see one or two big mutations with Miss Lily. Good job, Miss Lily. Let me give you some pets. You've been overeating, Missy. I can see that's why the food is missing. And there's some, some throw up on the ground. That's you, isn't it, Miss Lily? All right. Let's get Miss Lily puppeted. Let's clean up some of this poop real quick. And the half-eaten food. And then... Oh! Peapod! Are you just having such a hard time of life? Peapod has a few of the big genes. Um, or the big... There you go, there you go. Little pets for Peapod. Yeah, Peapod has a few of the large... The Magnilium uh, bacterium right now. Oh! And Peapod just ate a chip. Okay, that's adorable. We'll go ahead and get Peapod puppated. Alright. There we go. Let me clean up a little bit more. And then we've actually got quite a few of the large bacteria and a few very, very interesting super bacteria for big noses going on with Doodle. So let's see if Doodle is actually going to be our winner of the large genes. Oh, go fast, go fast. Oh, phew. Okay, I thought we wouldn't have time to mutate for a second. Mima, Green Bean is very tired and just wants to like puppet. But give me just a second, Green Bean. All right, let's get you some pets. Green Bean is like, for crying out loud, I just want to go to sleep in the den. Did you throw up, Green Bean? Because you don't have any of the, the mutations that I thought we were going to get. Oh, Green Bean doesn't want to eat. But Green Bean, you're our best bet. You are our best bet for being able to have a big dog. And you don't have a single big gene. Do you want to try to eat this bagel? You have two heads. All right, I'm going to praise you. Oh, those are some... Yes! Okay, so they have some of the big genes now. So let's get green bean puppeted. And look, guys, I don't have a lot of hope for Coats, but Coats is trying <laughs> with some of the special puppation genes. All right, there we go. Phew! Okay, so we have, like, everybody to hatch now. Come on, pizza party pups. <gasps> Miss Lily, you just unlocked the big headed achievement. Oh, and you're so shiny and pretty. Oh my gosh, I'll have so many pups. Yes. Okay, I'm pretty sure big headed just unlocked because I had a steam achievement pop up. Miss Lily. Woo! We're going to have so many pups from Miss Lily's line because that is just fantastic. Oh my gosh. All right, Miss Lily, good job. I'm very excited about that. What did we unlock? The phonograph! Okay! So it probably is actually the wide achievement that we are going for. We'll have to see if we can get there. Hey, Doodle. Are you going to surprise us by being, like, really wide now? For puppers? Is it proportionally? Wait! We just got new back legs! We now have 
six legs, which we have had on some of our dogs before, but it's a random mutation of 2% chance. I mean, come on. I mean, 2% more back legs is still two back legs. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, let's see. Body size has gone up. Girth has gone way down. We are now very flat. Uh, snout length has randomly mutated down. The glossiness of the ears. Wait, where'd our head go? How did we lose a head? Head number down 50%. Did you guys know that could happen? Doodle. Doodle, no. Doodle lost one of their brains. I don't even know how to process this. How two heads are not better than three. I don't even, I didn't even know that could happen. Did you guys even know that could happen? Doodle. Oh my gosh. Well, okay. Okay. Coats, are you going to shock us by like gaining a head? I'm really dubious about all of this now. Apparently we're going in directions I never thought. And meanwhile, Coats is like changing color. Leg color. Like length of legs is going way up. Body height is going down. Snout length is going up slowly. Ear length is going down. I don't think we got any random horns, but Coats is doing their best. Peapod, are you gonna suddenly gain like multiple heads and just shock the like badoodles out of me? What do we have? Peapod is actually going for a lot of width. Body height, no size, leg gloss, body length. Hmm. I feel like Peapod is trying really hard. Wow. Look at that! We have one of our very first properly mobile and like able to walk around itty bitty teeny tiny little pixel puppies. Peapod might be the new template for successful pixel puppies. I'm just saying you guys. Coats, are you doing okay? Do you need like help getting up on your feet? Okay, there you go, Coats. That happens sometimes. Did I just eat Coats? I'm so sorry, Coats! I thought I had put you down. But my mouse is dying lately, so I think that unfortunately I yeeted coats instead. All right, where's the last of our pups? Let's see, green bean. Think wide thoughts, really wide thoughts. Also, if you want to get more dots than just the one on your side, that'd be awesome. But like, no pressure. You're very cute. All right. Also, coat seems to like rolling around in whatever messes we have. Okay, meanwhile, snacks. You're gonna hatch into this big giant pile of pizza bagels. Oh, snacks! Okay, snacks kept all three of their heads, thank goodness. I have to start reading through these like alerts really carefully. Body size has gone up. Body height has gone up. Oh my word, like, whew. Getting a little nervous. The pizza party is still going strong though. So, okay, oh, somebody just, <gasps> Coats, you get all the praise for Dig. All the praise. I'm so proud of you. What'd you find? Classy floor. It looks like something in a casino. So I'm a little scared of it, but that's okay. Also, other than cotton... Oh, cotton ball! <gasps> Ooh, lily pad floor. Oh, cotton ball, I love you. And a little piano. Oh, a piano is perfect. You guys, piano is so perfect for this section. Oh my gosh. Okay. And I actually have not upgraded dens yet. We have one den upgrade for jungle den. I think I might make Coats my official digging dog and I might spend some time focusing on like a digging dog soon. Uh, also, Rosebush is a teen. I am trying to figure out like who else would make a good dog for adding to this side of, of the equation with our, our guard dogs. Maybe this one? Like our, are we wide? Because we want to have our ghost guard dogs, right? So uh, who would be a good ghost guard dog addition? Maybe this one? Very cute droopy face. Big fluffy tail. Maybe we'll get, maybe Cotton Ball will live long enough as an ancient that we'll be able to get something more. Um, meanwhile, everybody else. Oh wait, Doodle is an adult now. <gasps> Yay! 
And Snacks is an adult now. Oh my gosh, Doodle and Snacks are adults. Okay, well, in honor of the ancient cotton ball, let's actually go ahead and let's have uh, Doodle and Cotton Ball have a pup. We'll, we'll go ahead and mix those two together just to see what we happen to get. So we've got Cotton Ball. And then let me go ahead and grab Doodle. I need to go ahead and save Doodle. Uh, poor, they lost a whole head. But I need to save Doodle now that they're an adult. So I'll have to remember to do that. And then let's go ahead. Are you sure you like to breed the selected dogs? Yes. It's been so long since we've made a new dog. <gasps> oh my gosh. You guys! Look at that square eye! Oh, there's two with square eyes! Oh, it looks so cool! Oh my gosh! I can't wait! It's gonna be so much fun to try to find all of these new types of dogs. There's two with square eyes I just crossbred. It looks like we have one large one with square eyes over here. I may not play this one too hard. <gasps> Oh my gosh, look at the curly tail. Look at this. Oh, there's so many new things to look at. This one has like a really curly tail. Okay, that's just too cool. That's just way too cool. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh, we're really risking the biscuit. I'm gonna cr try crossbreeding these guys. Please give me more curly tails, yes. Okay, so we have more curly tails. And we have a lot of really fun colors. All right, let's try these guys. I would like to get more than one head. And then we'll see how this works out. So here's a curly, two curly tails with a very big head, deep voice. I would like to get the like blue coloration. I think the tails are even different. Like these are different kinds of tails now. Okay, let's try this one and this one. Oh, wow. This is our very first time popping in. Oh, we lost the tail. Curses. Okay, I've been greedy. And now the square eyes are like flat square eyes. Okay, I've been, I got greedy. I should have just gone with the very first dog we found, but I couldn't help it. All right, maybe if we keep going. You know, in for a penny, in for a pound of puppies at this point. Oh, hey! Okay, this one's a very large dog with curly tails. Whoops, it flipped on its back. It has really fun colors. It's got really long curly tail. <gasps> that would be such a fun replacement, for, excuse me, such a fun inheritor. Oh, look at the face on this one! <laughs> oh my gosh, this one has such a cute little distressed mouth. Okay, I like this one. I have fallen in love with it. It's so cute. It's so cute. You guys, that's amazing. We have so many new types of mutations to discover for these dogs, and we haven't even unlocked a ton of the new bacteria. This is going to be awesome. All right, guys, if you guys could, do please leave a like for Cotton Ball's new air. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.